Hydroxyapatite, otherwise known as bone mineral, is the mineral form of calcium phosphate. It comprises between 50 to 70% of adult bone mass. Hydroxyapatite is comprised of calcium phosphate molecules plus a hydrogen and oxygen molecule known as a hydroxyl group. When bonded together, this is known as an apatite. So hydroxyl plus apatite equals hydroxyapatite. The majority of the body's calcium content is stored in the hydroxyapatite in our bones, and as mentioned before, that hydroxyapatite makes up a majority of bone mass. The hexagonal crystal structure of hydroxyapatite allows dense packing of molecules, which gives the bone majority of its strength. The combination of hydroxyapatite, collagen, and small amounts of magnesium, sodium, and bicarbonate creates a bone structure that is hard and slightly flexible, enabling us to do some pretty amazing things with our bodies. For one, allowing us to stand up straight without collapsing in on ourselves. Hydroxyapatite deposits have also been found in the pineal gland of the brain, which affects sleep patterns. As we get older, the pineal gland calcifies and collects deposits of hydroxyapatite known as brain sand. Due to the high hydroxyapatite content of the human bone, it has also, be, also been used to repair damage to the human skeleton. It is commonly used as a filler, replacing amputated bone, as well as a coating for prosthetic implants, which can encourage the existing bone to grow into the implants. Hydroxyapatite cement is used to repair skull and cranium defects. Bones are what give our bodies structure. The hydroxyapatite found in our teeth allows us to tear and grind up food for digestion. The strength of our skeleton protects our vital organs, meaning we can, especially in our younger years, throw our bodies around in all sorts of ways without destroying our insides. As we get older, the balance of bone mineral and collagen changes, with the percentage of bone mineral increasing, making our bones less resilient to damage.